Shalom, everyone. I'm here on the Mount of Olives, and I'm here by the grave of the Orachayim Hakodesh. Orachayim was a very special, special tzaddik, sage. Many miracles that happened when people came to this grave to pray. And I wanted to come some, do something special here before the lockdown. The Orachayim was a tailor, and the governor once came because he was a very good tailor and he sent all the clothes for his family for the wedding that was coming up to the Orachayim to take care of and prepare and the Orachayim said no he says I don't have time why? because the Orachayim would only work enough to support his family and no more and the rest of the time he would learn Torah full time so the governor was very upset about this. He asked him again. Orachayim said, I don't have time to do it. So they threw the Orachayim in the lion's den. Now we have many stories of different sages, prophets that were thrown, Daniel, Michael, Azariah, that were thrown into the lion's den. But here was someone not such a long time ago thrown into the lion's den because he feared God and not man. So the governor threw him in the lion's den and the lions surrounded him. But we know from Torah, from the Talmud, that if someone is Yira Shamayim, the animals can't harm them. They, they, they fear a person who is connected to Torah. So they surrounded him in a circle. And as Dorachim was saying to them, in the lion's den. So, the governor was amazed. He heard the story. He came to watch. And then he pardoned him and he gave him nobility. So, this is the tzaddik here we're visiting the Orachayim Kodesh, the Bialy Rebbe Shlita. Told me that my soul root is connected to Orachayim Kodesh. I should come here in my times of troubles when I want to connect. So, that's why we're here. And thank you for joining me. Here at the Holy Orchaim. And furthermore, it says 
that the Baal Shem Tov wanted to connect to Or Chaim HaKodesh because he believed that if he connected to Or Chaim HaKodesh, then the two of their lights together would bring the Mashiach. So Baal Shem Tov wanted to travel to Eretz Yisrael to see the Or Chaim HaKodesh. I think he lived in Morocco, then he came to Akko to live, Haifa. And Baal Shem Tov wasn't able to. But when he heard that about, but when the Or Chaim came to Eretz Yisrael, he said that now Mashiach, Ben Yosef, I believe it was, is now in Eretz Yisrael. This is a great, great thing. This is a great night to Or Chaim HaKodesh to connect to him by learning his Svarim. You can come to the grave sometime. Be blessed, everyone.